right, so to solve this problem, we're going to notice that this second order ODE is actually a homogeneous expression since t equals zero, there's no functions of t involved here. So we're going to set up our characteristic equation, taking the coefficients of each of these terms here and multiplying them by the corresponding lambdas. So we're going to have 1 times lambda squared plus 2 times lambda minus 8 equals 0. So now we need to find the roots of this equation. So we can pretty easily just factor out this, this expression. It's going to be lambda plus 4 times lambda minus 2 equals 0. And from this, we very clearly see that lambda can equal negative 4 or 2. So then, we're going to remember that our, uh, our general form of the solution to this type of equation with uh, real roots, not complex roots, and not repeated roots. It's going to look something like uh, yt equals integrating constant times uh, lambda 1 t plus another integrating constant times e to the lambda 2 of t. So we can just take this as lambda 1, this first negative 4, and 2 as lambda 2, as you might expect. And that's going to give us our solution, which is yt equals c1 e to the negative 4t plus c2 e to the 2t. And that is our solution.